This is the Doctor, continuing the Prestige 16 playthrough of the Cursed Royal Woodlands map. I took a break, refocused myself, and I am ready. I was thinking about like what to do next, what's the priority. I think the first priority has got to be getting the... Um, getting the uh, flax field set up. Uh, so um, the flax field harvested so we can keep making meat you have a lot of meat to use so that's good um, I actually use consumption control to disable jerky uh, eating because the lizards don't really need to eat jerky right now we can make skewers to keep everyone fed I think that's a better use of our resources so I need I need that uh, small warehouse built and then that should be the priority right now. Yes, and I'm gonna need more planks because the next priority is to set up the uh, district once I get this harmony altar converted. That will be a lot of good resources. Um, that'll be doubling my yields, so that'll be strong. And I want to put down a forager's camp, a uh, herbalist camp, to get these mushrooms. I think I concluded there were no good trade routes. Okay, do I training problem solver now? Sure. The hostility can take it. Let's get the villagers now. Their cornerstone. Cheap construction. Yeah. That's, um, we can delete buildings and get the refunds and so forth. Especially valuable for stuff like the parts. All right, let's delete the blight post. We can use eggs, and meat, make skewers. Yes, seems good. Uh, we have extra planks now. That's also very good. Don't need these rain collectors after this. Two humans planting away. What we need to do is build a small herb here. Thinking right there is good. Another order. It could be a timed order. Let's take a look. Nope. Clearance water. Salvage runes. Oof. Both of these are pretty rough. I don't know. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna pick that yet. Bricks is something I have a lot of. Nine bricks is, um, and, ooh, seven coal for four. That's a pretty good deal. Ideally, I sell enough resources to get up to the next tier. So let's prioritize the brick production. Put a villager in here to harvest the vegetables. Then everyone else just build, build, build. Trader. Good stuff. Ways of the forest. Hostility reduction. I might... I might go for that somehow. You could sell off some tools or something. Is there a quick trade route I could do? None that I want, though. Not really. Ugh, I have to buy eight amber. Still, the hostility reduction, those tend to be like among the best um, things. Like, I might delay my victory by a little bit, but it's fine. Hey, 
Okay. Leather worker or brickyard. I have a source of leather, and the water skins will be useful. Fabric has some limited uses. Pigments kind of meh. Brickyard would allow me to make the crystallized dew, which could be important for victory. And I would no longer need to make bricks at the kiln. The pottery is nice, too. I think I kind of like the brickyard. Alright, we don't need to make bricks here. Let's focus on the coal production. And we'll put down a brickyard. Yes. Um... That's a good place for a brickyard. Um, you know what? I'll move you out of the way. I do quite like the brickyard right here. As soon as I harvest these vegetables, um, I'll be fine. I can also just build a road like that. Okay, with nine builders, surely we can like build these things in a timely and efficient manner, everyone. Back. Let's do that. Start gathering the resources I need. Okay, put a li uh, lizard there. Get that stuff built. Let's do that. Okay. Next, we need, um, you're working on calming the spirits. Wow. We need Maybe some lizard houses. In this region. Big shelters are always nice. And now I can start thinking about like delating buildings. Not all the buildings. I've learned my lesson not to delate the buildings with the uh the drizzle water. There's plenty of other buildings I could delete. Small herbalist camp would be nice right now. I could just build two big shelters over here. kind of weird though hmm maybe I just buy eight oh right I need the amber okay so now this makes me want to just buy some pipes or tools I'll get more pipes so I don't need pipes I if I buy eight tools I can um uh, get a nice Do I have a way to make tools right now? No. But the crystallized dew is good for the foxes, so I kind of want to break open this. Plus one fabric production. Eh, it's nice, but it's not necessary. Let's put 
Chop all that stuff down. Plenty of uh, work for my villagers to do. So I know about the corruption. Don't worry, we're working on it. Fox in here to on the bricks. Limit of I don't know, sixty or something. Um. That camp, and then we'll start building some resolve buffs over there. Um, use the jerky to make the skewers. Like I need to make the skewers like quicker. Okay, how much? Oh, I can't afford. Can't afford that. I'm sure there'll be another opportunity to get more uh, packets of tools. I'll just, I'll pass on your resources and your things. Can't buy anything from the merchant. Just don't have the resources right now. to build a I want to start building stuff like the lizard house and the fox houses but big shelter will be good for now now I get more of these uh, trees chopped out of the way I delete the geyser. Uh, no, that's probably not a good idea, but like you could, I could delete those resources. Okay, we are making progress. I feel like I need to put at least one lizard in to make the meat. Then making a lot of extra coal is useful. Need it to fight the blight. Okay. Okay, things are things are happening. Things are going well. Let us construct the usual barrels and benches. In fact, this seems to be a barrel area. We'll build four barrels. Okay, let's avoid glades and we're gonna put you here to chop all that stuff down. 
Need some room for houses. A second lizard to make some meat. Trader else do I have? I could sell one tool for two amber. 14 clay for three. Neither of these are great deals, but sell them to proc my thing. And I want to start gathering some clearance water. Oh, new villagers, excellent. I actually don't think I need uh, need more parts. But I might just want five villagers. However, I'm about to get a ton more villagers. A little worried about overloading. Three copper bars can be converted into pipes. I might just want like slightly fewer villagers so it's easier to control what's going on. Um, because I think I actually have enough stuff for everyone to do right now. human in there making making resources started thinking about putting down the tea doctor to get the double production buff once I have the harmony altar double production buff very powerful Okay, we're making lots of uh, meat. Pretty satisfied. Go help build. How much fuel do I have? 14, that's more, should be more than enough. Good trade routes, or any trade routes I can do, really. Should construct some fabric.
down some lizard houses. can get four more villagers and two pipes right now. Do I want that? Like, literally, this moment. Hmm. What would I do with my villagers? Put the three people into T-Doctor just to get that vitality. Eh, it's kind of weak. I could start making a press you have mushrooms coming making a flower to to get ready to make biscuits is not bad our food situation is acceptable And I get another blueprint, which is pretty important. Herbalist camp. Yeah, I think that will do work for us. Don't forget, we have another source of fertile soil, another plantation. That will give me infinite supplies of skewers. Okay, okay. Good. Yeah, herbalist camp is good choice. Yeah, gather that herb quick. We need um we need more parts back. And there are ways to do that, but Do need a hmm. What do I build the plantation here would be ideal. We can build a small warehouse like right there. Okay, let's man. Cutting is a difficult job. Let's get you moved over here so we can chop some of those trees down. Want that tree chopped down eventually. Then we need a small warehouse. I have exactly one right there. got the converted spirit altar that is amazing we'll put this right in this corner there then I want to buff up the main town with the double production buffs so perhaps need two chests two anvils then perhaps a, a park and then two 
barrows and a bench, two barrows and two benches. Okay, everybody go build like crazy. And we'll build a lizard house right there. In fact, this one should probably get priority just to house some more of my villagers. Okay, things are happening. Making skewers, excellent. Gonna put another lizard in here to make that jerky a little quicker. Okay, we cleared that stuff out. Small warehouse getting built. I have six builders. Surely you can all build like quicker. What's the blight from the sky? Ooh, okay, no, no, no. We can't deal with that blight rod. We gotta lower that up. Okay, and then we'll send two firefighters in. Should be fine now. Everybody just build. Your planning should be more than enough. All right, everyone else, build, build, build. Come on. It's so much to build. So little time. Okay, you're finally buffing up the main town. Let's move the park back there. Okay, we have a district, so now everybody should be getting plus 10% yield buffs. It's very good. Sell some ale and fabric. I'll sell one tool. How did I get all these insects? Sure. Don't want to sell the ale. That could come in handy. Make more fabric. Cut that wood. Got the small warehouse going, herbalist camp going, forager camp going. Let's, um. Where do I move? These things like the benches can go back there, and the houses, the barrels can fit over here. Maybe just put the random treasure chests like over there. Okay, and anvils and can go back behind the blight post. Okay, let's take a nice, pretty screenshot of this town at this stage of the game. My six workers. Start building the press. It's pretty simple building.
but useful. Also, just put the press right here. We'll move the barrels out of the way. That actually seems really good. Okay, the blight rot situation seems to be under control. What we need is more skewers of all things. And a plantation right there. Tag, this should be the highest priority. Okay, we don't need more wood chopping over there. I think we're good. But I would not mind chopping down some of those. <sighs> I mean, I might eventually use enough clearance water. I don't know if I can salvage all these runes, so... Pick power to clearance, just because I don't really have a better choice there. in the lizard home. Might as well use that clearance water. Okay, I've come. I've actually completed 60 bricks somehow. That's amazing. I think we're good on the bricks for now. Two humans into the plantation. I don't really want to sell any of this other stuff. Start deleting buildings and then rebuilding them. For example, planks are good. And we can start rebuilding human houses um, over here. I can rebuild this small warehouse just to get a little one part back. I don't know that that's worth it though. I mean, I'm gonna get a lot of parts back once I delete this forager's camp. Don't need the parts right now. Build decorations. Park here isn't a bad idea. And then a um, perhaps some night ferns. That seems fitting for this map.
Thinking this is a year six win, I think I should be able to swing that. This stuff over here is cleared out. Don't really feel the need to open a glade, but I do feel the need to clear out stuff here. Park over there. Too many villagers. Okay. Oh, where am I getting all the insects from? I don't know. And ooh, gotta focus on that coal production now. No, I don't quite care. All trade routes are faster. That's actually useful. Eventually, I'll take that. Another order. Uh, yeah, discovering two forbidden glades is amazing. But how am I? How do I know which one's a forbidden glade? Right? It's just it's too difficult to know. Need for pie, need for skewers. It's easy enough to have the need for skewers and the need for jerky fulfilled. I don't know how I do the need for pie. I don't actually know that I can do any of these. Unless I cut through to another farm field. Uh, to another glade and find like fertile soil. So I don't know that that last order is doable. Yeah, let's start thinking about like how to gain more resolve. Service buildings, I think, are gonna be the key. Who's the next trader? Oh, I could have tools. I do have quite a bit of amber now that I can spend. So that's good. Make luxury goods in the press. If I had some way to make these other items, I would be set, but. Let's see what the trader brings. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna be able to discover two forbidden glaze. That's that's a pretty no-brainer one to get rid of. Okay. You have tools. Ooh, you have good stuff. But our problem is that I don't have a way to make the luxury goods. At least 20 harmony decorations. I just have to build 11 more of these. That's really not that bad. 
Which one of these two do I want to open? If I open this, the box of crystallized dew could have a lot of uses. And the pickled goods could have a lot of uses. And the flower, they're all good. So I kind of want to open this other cache to send to the Citadel. So. Buy 10 tools. Ugh, expensive stuff, but I can afford it. Let's give you a little extra bricks. There we go. I have a lot of bricks, but... Okay, let's get a two foxes working on that large abandoned cache so I can see what my next thing is. A favorite of foxes. And I think that's good. Oh, I've already uh, harvested that flax field. Wow. That was fast. Need to move my uh, camp over at the soon as opportunity. Oh, don't need you two in there. And you can make vegetables, skewers. I guess I can start building the fire shrines and stuff, like... Let's build four lizard posts to start. We're gonna need these harmony buildings. I might buy some of the uh, trade goods and stuff off the vendor. But not, not yet. Yes, yes, corruption. We're dealing with it. Should build some fire shrines. Maybe one more lizard post. Reputation, excellent. Everybody come help build. Let's move these lizard posts over to the lizard land. One last lizard post. Oh right, the trader went away. Eh, I don't think I needed to buy anything off him anyway. Probably better for me to have um, other resources. All right, more villagers. I quite like the reeds on the left. 25 reeds could be what I need. We've been hate building another crude workshop just to get the planks cranked out, but we'll see what um we'll see what we get from the recipes uh, from the blueprints. I mean, I 
have too many workers now. Might as well put three workers into the tea doctor. Get the plus one resolve. Is this the time to start making biscuits for the humans? Sure. I don't, I don't hate making a second crude workshop just to uh, get some of these buildings, uh, get some more planks real quick. At the very least I should flip Put one fox into the brickyard. Might actually no, no no. What we do is instead of making bricks, we should make some pottery. Okay, small forger's camp is empty. That's part of what I expected. This chest out of the way right there. Can't favor any other species to Oh nine point nine nine really Okay, glade event complete. Alchemist Hut can make um the tea. A little tricky though. It also makes crystallized dew pretty efficiently. Meanery makes pickled goods and porridge. I actually would have some difficulty making that. I could make pickled goods pretty easily be best that's plus eight and I'll have a uh, berries uh, plenty to make the pickled goods and I can still make crystallized do uh, the tea is only good for foxes I I want like the brawling thing I'll pick the beanery pickled goods could be how we uh, power ourselves to victory Okay, I have a. I'm build a thing over here. Um, instead of the T Doctor giving a plus one resolve that does nothing, let's move our workers to haul stuff. What I'm actually going to do is delete this shelter. Going to put down some better houses. Okay. Work on the planks. Gonna move this crude workshop out of the way, maybe back there, down the beanery. Oh, wow. 
Okay, we should be able to put you down. I do not hate, like, starting on some crystallized dew. The 80 million insects and in clay that I have and drizzle water. See if I can get the foxes happy enough. This is worth connecting the rain pump. Okay. And what I really want to build are fox homes. This camp is empty. That's fine. Because we got more where that came from. Oh, I need two more harmony buildings? I just counted that wrong. Ah. Going. Alright, well, more fires, I'm thinking, is the way to go. What sort of trade routes do I have? I don't even know that I want any of these. The seven T is pretty good if I had T. I need to use clearance water somehow. Goods. Box homes, yes. Down two fox homes here. Okay, make the skewers. I'm gathering a lot of berries. Excellent. I have no other way of using clearance water except for the press. I don't want to use. So I can't do that one. I don't know how I do this last one either. Tool shop or smithy. Okay, these are both good. Making tools is a way for us to win. 
Definitely good stuff. Mithy looks a little better since I can uh, put lizards in there and they'll be happier. You guys making the planks? Make some more crystallized dew after this. Where's my other woodcutter camp? Oh, okay. Uh, I want to expand this in case. Um, yeah. Fox house here. Potentially favor the humans and get a little rep that way. But I'm thinking I need to open a glade. Maybe this one. See what resources we can find. Try to find some caches to win with. Deploy some firefighters. Oh, we'll put a fox in here. It's fine. Then I do need some workers building stuff so you can build. Oof, this um this plantation not doing well. Okay, this is all fine. Eating double food. I don't want them to eat double food. some pickled goods and put two workers in there to haul supplies around build some more fox houses and stuff whoa how is blight at 484% it's oh the hostility 4 thing wrecked me ah all right, all right, that's fine. We're gonna lose some villagers, but it's acceptable. 
I uh, I better build a second blight post to make sure I don't lose too many villagers. I need two um, two parts. So where am I gonna get my two parts from? Just delete one of these camps. The uh, forager's camp is the least important. In fact, I could even just rebuild it. All right, come on, build a blight post. That is the priority. And in fact, I might want to uh, turn down the rainwater usage just because. Okay, human builder die, that's okay. Fox beanery worker, I prefer that to not happen. Ooh, firekeeper, lizard die, that's. Definitely problematic. Okay, let's put villagers in here. I'm gonna need to use the coal. All right, everybody fight the fire. Okay, you can you can go back to making jerky now. Okay. Well, Blight's not actually under control. I might lose three more villagers. I'll still win, but it's kind of annoying. Here, I'll sell a little coal. I have a lot of coal now. Okay, I can do one more order. I can do one of these. Let's boot out a villager. Haunted Market. Ah, intriguing. If I can cleanse that, good things will happen. There is a spirit. Fulfill treatment, brawling, or porridge. Well, that's not going to happen. But he's going to be gone in 45 minutes. And there is another uh, abandoned large cache, which is good. So we need to we need to focus on winning now. So that means the tool shop, the smithy that uses storm water. That's going to be the most important building. Ooh. Of an awkward uh I guess I can build it here. That seems pretty good. I just need more uh, villagers to do stuff. All right. Thank you. 
Can I build another Frizzle Pump? Geyser Pump? Yeah. New Threat Fishman Lighthouse. Yeah, this one's definitely a threat. But I have time to deal with this. This is a forbidden glade. Oh, I didn't even realize this was a forbidden glade. There is a clearance water. So 80 million clay that I can't do anything with. Ugh, I'm gonna lose more villagers, aren't I? Is there any way I can slow down the, uh... The thing, but I, I don't think so. I'm not gonna lose the game from this, but it is, it's just annoying. And flower for four is actually a shockingly good deal. down give me the crate of tea the tea which I can use right the doctor that would give me a little more rep with the foxes I think I have to burn this down which means I gotta be careful with how much coal I use So if I make the enough tools, I can get two rep. Probably gain another rep from the foxes. I mean, farm field could happen because this looks like there's 13. I can make the crops, packet of crops. I need 40 packet of crops. So that's two pips. Two pips, two pips there. I need two pips from Resolve. I Bet I could do that. Especially once I burn the Fishman Lighthouse down and get the treatment thing going. And I have money that I can use on luxury goods and stuff. Okay. So this is looking quite doable. Oh, I lost my uh, villagers here. Hmm. Let's delete the... I want my buff. Um, delete the shelter. Gonna be able to burn the blight rot down in time? I hope so.
Yep. Okay. Wow. By the skin, your teeth. Pools are always nice. Chop all that down. Where's my uh, other lumber camp? I think I moved them both up here. Okay. Void glades, avoid glades. Chop all this stuff down. And then burn this thing down after the. Uh... Okay. New cornerstone. Oh, houses have room for one more villager. That's not bad. What cutter is prayer? No, I cannot afford to lose my fuel. What do I really need? Yeah, you know what? Crowded houses does something. I don't have to build more houses. That's that's something. Hey. Okay. Generous donation would just give me 0.5 rep. Um, I could probably do better though. If I had the training gear. Yeah, probably buy the training gear from you. We'll see what else we can get as well. One part for five amber is a excellent deal. And I actually have more parts than it seems. Oh, year six. This year, there's going to be like tons and tons of problems. Okay, wow. Well. Cleanse the market. Eh. It's good to fix that thing up, if only for the carts. Minus three global result, that's fine. This might be a year seven win. It's looking like that. one of the bricks just for the resources small forger camp is empty okay that's part of what i was expecting i'm gonna need two blight posts actually is there anything else i can uh delete for parts not really I think I want the four pipes from you right now. Just buy that first. Um, all right, I can get the robots going. I should buy eight pipes, actually. Now I'll sell two wildfire essences. I'm not gonna build another hearth, let's be real. I'll sell four so I have enough to build two robots. Then I'll sell you a little money. And boot 
you out. Build a robot here. Build a robot there. That's it. We'll start making a packet of crops. Use that clearance water. Why don't I have enough coal? Take that coal out. I need to get this um, thing burned down. Then we should be able to get a nice resolve boost to win. Guess I want four more pipes. to upgrade this. No blight post. make any more flour. Let's uh, focus on the skewer production. Yep. That's like the one resource I have tons of. Where did all my coal go? I can't I can't afford to have the coal here. For now, let's turn off the purging fire production. Come on, we need to get this like Fishman Lighthouse dealt with. Okay, buy all the training gear. It's fine. But now is not quite the time to turn it on yet. I'm gonna turn it on at the right moment is not this moment. Sorry, la. Are you working on this yet? Might as well build the farm fields now. Don't hit a small warehouse here. Then I want to sell probably two parts to Danger Zone. Okay. Then I'm going to aid for the human clan, get three extra humans. Um, keep making packet of crops. We still need packet of crops. goods we can turn on the pollution now okay turn all that stuff on What do we do?
out of the herbalist camp. Getting the haunted market turn on will also be supremely helpful. send some villagers what's the blight post normally costs two okay so I can delete this to get one part back send y'all to we do need more purging fire herbless camp it's empty like that Fabric. And then let's put more workers in the warehouse. To haul goods around. Honestly, I I don't need bricks. It's not doing anything. Probably use the lumber to make the uh, tools. Yes, I know about the blight rot sis. It's gonna be real bad. Uh, don't have enough to make all the packages of crops, but use what you can. Use the training to it. Clay? I actually have a lot of clay. I'll get the berries soon enough. All right, everyone is now super happy uh, because of the haunted market. Let's turn on um, this is the time to get everyone super psyched. 
Get that resolve up to astronomical heights. And then I just need 24 tools. Might not even need all 24. They're all making like... Okay, good. Lizards. Get that rep going. Hopefully, I win this year. Don't have to mess around. Okay, we have enough packet of crops, so we're done with the packet of crops. Don't know that I need more uh, people, but the farmer is carrying more supplies. Is nice. And we can boot one villager out. Suppose I could make some oil. The other thing I can do is use the drizzle water to keep everyone happy. Okay, okay, let's boot all this stuff out. Um, let's keep getting happier, everyone. I should let the east lizards eat the thing. Oh boy. How's the coal situation looking? Not good. But I want to keep the lizards in there for their happiness. Okay, I have enough to open one more cache. Um, I'm gonna call the trader immediately. six seconds okay we're gonna have um that massive light rot problem we need to send the villagers back to uh gonna have so much blight rot 
Y'all, everyone's building the coal, right? Okay. And I kind of actually need oil. Need to burn oil. We'll see what supplies we can buy off the um, the lady. Get some more tools. Oh, generous donation is 0.5. That could be just the right amount to win. Let's let's see. Wait just a little bit. Gotta time this very, very carefully. Okay. I don't actually know that I get enough, but 18 tools is 41. I am not even remotely close to being able to buy that. Oh, that's not true. I have all these parts I can sell off. That is not true. I don't need any of those parts. If I open this other cache, I just win. Okay. I only need 18. Okay. You can have all the packet of crops. You can have all the parts. I don't need those anymore. Uh, you can have all of the bricks. I don't need any of those. Have one packet of provision. No, that's a bad deal. All right, this is good enough. Now I need to redeploy two foxes to open that cache so that we just win. You can go help. All right. Okay, we win. We just got to survive the storm. We can uh, look at our beautiful village as it burns down due to insane amounts of blight rot. It's 800%. Yep. I could lose just because I don't have enough... Um, uh, just because of impatience. Use whatever fuel you have on hand to make more. I might have to buy your purging fire. We'll see how desperate the situation gets. Oh, I could... Silly down a little bit. Don't eat too much. Lizard Rancher has died. That's okay with me. A firefighter dying. That's not okay. Okay, I think what we need to close this game out is literally all the purging fire you got on hand. I am willing to sell anything at this point. Not the coal. The fabric is pretty useless to me. Yeah. Ooh, Fox Scout died. I don't like that. Let's, um, have you help. Alright, the 
good news is I have enough purging fire to burn every light rosses down. And I don't think I'm going to lose. Whoo, this was a close game. All right. It's going to take some beautiful screenshots right here. Wait, 16.82? Oh, okay, I, I am, I am uh, doing both. All right, good, good, good. No worries. What is my last blueprint? Greenhouse or clothier? Don't really need either. More villagers, that would not help me. So I'm not gonna take them. Yep, a few more villagers died. It's fine. Human hauler has died. Human farmer has died. This is all, all perfectly fine. Thirty seconds to victory. Interesting game. Light Rot has proven very, very tough on this particular uh, map, on this particular run, due to the forest modifier that generated additional Light Rot. Good thing for the kiln. We were able to make tons of fuel from that, which needed that to win. Okay, and then Prestigious Expedition 16. I'm just going to take some more screenshots of our town being overrun by blight rot. Is this a better look? Not really. Oh, that's a good look right there. All right. Move on. Okay, I could do once more settlement and then do the seal. Why not? I haven't done a coral forest in a while. But a marshlands is also pretty fun. I haven't done one of those too, either. What's prestige 17? Stronger hunger penalty? Eh, I don't let my villagers get hungry. So that seems pretty relevant. When um, prestige 16, Okay, very good. A tough game. That was a, that was a tough one. Then I think I want the uh, trading upgrades now. Get, get my way to stocked caravans will be sweet for the, uh, for the seal. Yeah, 20% more resources. That That's probably just what I need to beat that map. You have anything to say, Aunt Lori? Uh, I wouldn't say I'm struggling. Yeah, some villagers died here and there, but that hardly means I'm struggling. Oops, that is not what I meant to click on. All right, that seems like a good place to stop this video. Thank you for watching. Until next time.